finding the surface area of a sphere. In this module, you will learn to find the formula for the surface area of a sphere. Recall that the curved surface area of a cylinder is the product of the circumference of its circular base and height. We'll use this information in an activity to find the formula for the surface area of a sphere in terms of its radius. For the activity, we need a sphere and a cylinder of equal radius. The height of the cylinder should equal the diameter of the sphere. We also need a pair of scissors, a roll of orange and red thread, a pin, a cutter and a black sketch pin. Use the cutter to divide the sphere into two hemispheres. Fix the pin on top of the hemisphere. Start from the pin and wrap the orange thread around the curved surface of the hemisphere to form a spiral. Mark the length of the thread and cut it at that point. Unwind the thread from the hemisphere and keep it aside. Now wrap the red thread around the curved surface of the cylinder to form a spiral. Mark the length of the thread and cut it at that point. Unwind the thread from the cylinder. Compare the length of the two threads. We can see that the length of the red thread is two times the length of the orange thread. This shows that the curved surface area of the hemisphere is half the curved surface area of the cylinder. If the radius of the hemisphere is R, then the radius and height of the cylinder is R and 2R respectively. So, the curved surface area of the cylinder is 2 pi R into 2R. The curved surface area of the hemisphere is 2 pi R square. The total surface area of the sphere is 2 times the curved surface area of the hemisphere. Thus, the total surface area of the sphere with radius r is 4 pi r square. This is the formula for the surface area of a sphere. In this module you have learned surface area of a sphere with radius r is 4 pi r square.